years ago, downtown property owners banded together with the support of the City of Corpus Christi to create the Corpus Christi Downtown Management District. Three decades later, this 2021 impact report shows how that legacy has been carried forward. With support from the community, our neighbors, and new leadership across all levels of government, we have advanced our founders' request to work collaboratively to create the most vibrant downtown on the Gulf of Mexico. Hello, I'm Elizabeth Edda Mason, Executive Director for the Downtown Management District. 2021 was a restorative year for the DMD, finding ways to bring the community back together after a year-long hiatus due to COVID-19. Our bored and freshly energized team worked strategically to make substantial improvements that positively impacted the greater downtown area by providing enhanced cleaning, beautification, and safety services, developing and improving the downtown economic market, marketing and promoting an exciting cultural district, and building an effective downtown organization that is passionate about moving downtown forward. These key areas of focus are what keeps our downtown economic engine turning. Let's take a closer look. In district operations, our eight-person clean team worked 365 days, collecting 40,000 bags of trash, sweeping 55,000 block faces, and spending 17,000 hours servicing the district. We brought the sparkle back to our historic Main Street on Chaparral by illuminating over 100 trees through Mayor Paulette Guajardo's Illuminando Downtown Initiative presented by Corpus Christi Medical Center. And through city partnership, we invested over $400,000 to convert five one-way streets to two-way streets that now seamlessly connect the shoreline bayfront to the downtown area. We also invested $150,000 into beautifying Artesian and La Retama parks, refreshing over 1,800 flowers, and providing 11,000 planter upkeeps throughout the district. To develop and improve, in 2021, businesses once again flourish with the opening of 10 new businesses and no business closures. We awarded and paid $540,000 to businesses for completed projects with support from the Downtown Reinvestment Zone. With the city support, we were able to spend $50,000 in Texas CARES Act funding to provide pop-up patios to downtown businesses that were in need of assistance during the pandemic, making downtown an iconic outdoor dining destination and earning recognition in Texas Town & City Magazine. To understand post-COVID demand and market impact, we studied residential and parking demand in the downtown area, finding demand remains strong with 1,700 new units available for development in the next 10 years and an increase in parking utilization of 11% in the downtown Marina Arts and Waters Edge districts. In communication and events, we reached 2.4 million social media users on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. We hosted multiple events in the downtown area, drawing over 100,000 visitors to our area. And we know that number because we also have a new system in place, Placer AI, that enables us to track attendees in the downtown area utilizing their phones. This year, we were able to successfully bring back ArtWalk post-COVID in the form of two street closures now known as ArtWalk block parties. This transition now brings close to 20,000 people to an ArtWalk event on that first Friday night. We launched the weekly Downtown Run Club, establishing an entire new segment of downtown stakeholders while leveraging our beautiful natural resources of the Bayfront. That program has brought over 1,200 runners to participate and take a wonderful run on a Wednesday night. This holiday season, we elevated our downtown visitor experience by enhancing our holiday decorations and hosting holiday events, which drew in over 32,000 people and reached 190,000 people on social media. This includes the 66-foot HEB Christmas tree with a lighting in Water's Edge Park, the Port of Corpus Christi Holiday Tree in La Retama Park, and the illuminated boat parade sponsored by the Port of Corpus Christi, Mayor's Merriest Downtown Decoration Competition hosted by NEC Co-op Energy, and Artesian Park Holiday Wonderland, which gives recognition to our Downtown Advisory Council supporters. Thanks to our 29 Merchant Association members, we had support and coordination throughout the year during the holidays and other special events. In organizational management, our team managed $788,000 in reinvestment zone funds, 314 in interlocal support from the City of Corpus Christi, and fundraised $228,000 from sponsorships, grants, and events. Our downtown property owners really appreciate these matching funds that go along with the DMD levy to fund our organizational operations. 
We would like to say thank you to the City of Corpus Christi, our advisory council members, the community, and all of our partners who continue to invest in the future of downtown Corpus Christi. Over the course of 2021, we successfully recruited five additional team members from across the country to build out a team of dynamic, passionate individuals dedicated to moving downtown forward. And I want to be sure to recognize those individuals as none of our 2021 accomplishments would have been possible without the dedication of our wonderful team. Our greatest labor of love this year was the development and adoption of our new five-year strategic plan, which sets a challenging and bold agenda for the future of our community and organization. This plan includes a new vision and mission statement. The vision of the Downtown Management District is to create the most vibrant downtown in the Gulf of Mexico by instituting a clean and safe environment, creating a welcoming, well-designed waterfront, developing a robust, sustainable neighborhood, promoting remarkable, prismatic experiences, and growing our team capacity to accomplish that vision. And while we always aim to look forward, our annual impact report highlights the accomplishments that our team delivered to our community this past year. So what is the state of downtown in 2022? We're certainly still tenacious, but we're feeling more collaborative and energized than ever before.